Fuck, did I fuck up the angle? I want my baby shrimp, so I have to see it. Hi guys, I know this has been a really well requested um, YouTube video. I'm sorry I've been a little MIA. Let me show you guys what I have been thrifting so far. You know, you know me, the thrifting ain't gonna stop. It's good for the my closet and it's good for the environment. I don't even know where to begin. I went to Plato's Closet, Buffalo Exchange, and Goodwill. So I'll go by category and let's, you know what? Let's start from the expensive to the lowest. So let's get started. So the first thing, well not the first, this is the last thing I got while I was at Buffalo, Buffalo Exchange. So we're gonna do Buffalo Exchange first. Um, this is a cute little tiny purse, you know, it's a little dusty, I know. That's okay, it kind of looks like, you know, like back in the days in the 1800s, the dentists or the, no, the doctors, they would have the little suitcases, the little bags. Um, well, what about it? What are they about to do? Get their stethoscope and then just put it in. But yeah, this is how it looks. Such a good bag for when I just want to carry my phone, my wallet, and that's it. Perfume and all that could fit in here. So I don't have to carry my big old bag. Um, and this was $18, which I think it's all right because you can tell it's vintage. It smells like it. And you know that kind of smell. So yeah, that's the first, the last thing I got at Buffalo Exchange. This is a complicated shirt. I'm no, just kidding. This is a beautiful shirt, um, blouse, and it has a little loose ends at the bottom, and it's a wrap, wrap around. It literally wraps around me, and I tie it up. It still has the the brand on there. It says it's India Boutique, and I got this one for eleven, which I don't think is that bad considering this is the only shirt that's ever fit me that is like a wrap around shirt i like this shirt because it's so girly like i need to amp up my closet and put more girly things and i think this is a really good blouse statement and i love the floral print so this one i think yeah this one was the first shirt i got at buffalo and i just love the colors it reminded me like of a of a dad shirt this one is from nicole nicola like Michael My Mikael Myers and it has like a horse and a, you could tell it's like a, a rural person or something and it's just beautiful colors and I love I tried it on with my shorts and I thought it looked absolutely cute and this one was $13 it's a one of a kind and a, a really good statement in your closet and this one is from Urban shout out to little Urban this is an extra small. Wow, I just noticed how much this was. Hmm. It was $21. Was I on drugs? What was I? Okay. Um, but I think it's really cute. It's a lavender color. I only have one piece in my wardrobe that is lavender and it's a beautiful shirt maybe with a, a tube top a white tube top so i had to go find find that um it's an extra small but it's stretched i'm gonna show you guys a clip of what it looks like um but it's a really beautiful color it looked better in the mannequin honestly because if they're like semi semi cropped and this one was like it fits me like full on cop but i mean i bought it it's done over with and sorry so this is a vintage, I just noticed there's this, well, my husband knows it was a stain. Um, I got upset. Nothing much we could do about it. And it was in Santa Ana. I'm not about to drive all the way over there. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna make this work because I still love it. Um, it's a vintage guess. And on the bottom, it, tell, it says 1989, actually. Let's see if you guys can see it. Yeah, 1989, and it's a crew neck. Um, this one, it says one size fits all. Wow, didn't know that. Um, for the tag, it's a size large, and I got it for $24. And it fits, did I try this on? I don't know, it fits me a little bit short on the sleeves, um, but honestly, I don't mind it. It's really cute. And this beautiful little gem, I've been looking for a shirt so similar to this all around, and I couldn't get my hands on this. And I saw it, and I'm like, wow, it has a good stretch to it. Let me see. That's where it's from, Urban Outfitters. A size medium, 
and it was $14.50, but on the tag it says small. And I tried it on and it fit cropped, but it still looked cute. Am I too late for the trend? I don't know, I bought it, I'm gonna wear it, you know? All that was from Buffalo Exchange and we're gonna go to Playlist Closet, Blackos Closet, like my friend likes to call it. Blackos, we're gonna, I'm gonna show you guys what I got at Blackos. Oh, also, the total for Buffalo Exchange was 109 which I've never spent $100 on something thrifted, which is crazy, but I am gonna wear those clothes definitely, and I love it. So I'm gonna show you Blackos. <laughs> Blackos. Okay, so this is a Forever 21 top. It's weird, cause like, this is a size small, and it fits me, cause look at the stretch to this. But it's really cute, it's really girly, and it has these little bows on top, and it's me like kinda cropped, but it's really cute. And super stretchy. It was for $7. Well, this is like a bralette crop top. I don't know what it is. And it's actually from Torrid. And I, Torrid, and I heard it's um kind of pricey there. I wish I heard it for this. I honestly can't find a tag. But I think it was like $11. And it says it's size 1. I think it's like a large or extra large. But it's so beautiful and comfortable. And I love it. And I have to have it. Have it. So, yeah. This one is a Guns N' Roses, but from H&M. And it looks a little worn in, you know, has a little ribs. And I actually don't have a shirt like this. Um, so I was like, you know what, I'm gonna I'm get it. I'm surprised it was still there hanging up. And I'm gonna get it. And it was for $7 in a size medium. So why not? And it's super comfortable and soft. Uh, total for Playlist Closet was, oh, it was $20, $22 or $20, $21. Okay, so I'm gonna go to Goodwill. This is from Cielo, and it says large. I got this for $3, and it's a really comfortable shirt, and you could tell a grandma wears it because um, my grandma has shirts like this, and I like it, it was soft, and I had to have it, and it fits me really cute. Okay, so the next thing is this one. It's like a Hawaiian blue shirt. It's a woman's shirt and it says medium. I think I also got this for $3. And look, there's a blonde hair. It comes with a blonde hair. Um, interesting. Uh, yeah, it's a beautiful color and I don't have nothing like this in the closet. It's just, you know, different unique the buttons or like little wooden buttons. That is so, so adorable. Wanted to jump on the bag wagon. Bag wagon bag wagon of um, cardigans so I got myself finally a cardigan that fits me and on my crop I might not depends how I'm feeling and this was most likely 350 I think it was 350 and this is actually from like a it's from, it's from dress barn and a size large so yeah um, I'm happy that I finally found a cardigan that actually fits me I've struggled so much to find one that does Okay guys, we're down to two skirts. Let's start. Let's get this started. We're almost ending in this video. This is a skirt that I found. It's from Prophecy in a size medium. And I think it's really beautiful, really, you know, flowy, really girly. It has um, these leaves are blue with like a cream color of flowers coming out of them. And yeah, maybe with a white tube top or how girls do it nowadays, a band tee, tied, like a tied up band tee on top of this. It would look really adorable and can't wait to wear it for spring, summer. The last skirt is from Jennifer Moore in a size 14. And the vintage sizing, I am a size 14, but originally I'm a, like in regular sizes, I'm a size 10. It's really beautiful. It ties up at the end and it has a zipper in the front for it to be, you could easily zip it up. It's really comfortable and with some sandals, like let's see some brown sandals and um, oh, like a, a little light blue tube top. I'm obsessed with tube tops. I don't know why. Yeah, this would be really cute. Okay, so that is my haul of Plato's Closet. Hey guys, I'm finally recording the ending of the video. Uh, my phone died and it only recorded to an extent, so I'm finishing the outro. And I was, I think my last words were, that's my haul from Buffalo Exchange, Goodwill, and Plato's Closet. And I hope you guys enjoyed that video. 
um i hope i record soon and just keep on pushing well thank you guys for watching and i hope you enjoy bye